The world is getting a look at something Thursday that we've never seen before. Something that is way out there. This is the first image of the supermassive black hole at the center of our very own Milky Way galaxy. Its name, Sagittarius A star. Until now, we didn't have the direct picture confirming that Sag A star was indeed a black hole. The international collaboration behind the Event Horizon Telescope worked for years to capture the image using a network of radio telescopes around the globe. It's the same group that unveiled the first ever photo of a black hole in 2019, but that one is in a different galaxy. This one is in our cosmic neighborhood. More than 300 researchers helped make it happen, including this Canadian. I uh, co-led one of the imaging teams that uh, produced this first image of Sagittarius A star, the black hole at the center of our galaxy. Avery Broderick is an astrophysicist with the Event Horizon Telescope Collaboration, who was in Washington, D.C. for the big reveal. He's also an associate faculty member at the Perimeter Institute and an associate professor with the University of Waterloo. As an average human who's just trying to wrap their head around all of this, can you please tell me what is a black hole and what makes this one super massive? So black holes are uh, quite literally gravity run amok. Uh, it is uh, the densest form that matter can take, uh, crushed down to a singularity, a single point at the heart of the object. The perfect prison from which not even light can escape. They're also um, astronomically the engines of the brightest and uh, most powerful events in the universe. Uh, the first black hole that we released a picture of, the one from M87, uh, it has a mass of six and a half billion suns. And by comparison, the one at the heart of our galaxy is a mere four million. It's stunning to think four million suns, the mass of that. So if you have three million, you could still fit another one million in there. That's right. That's right. What do we know now that we didn't know before we had this clear image? We gained a newfound certainty about uh, these, these objects at the hearts of galaxies. We gained a confirmation that really they are black holes. I'm thinking people might be hearing about this and you know, going through their mind is, you know, we've got so much going on in the world right now. Now you're telling me this black hole, should they be worried about this? Not about the one at the heart of our galaxy. Uh, it, it is 27,000 light years away. So that's still comfortably distant. Um, we are not going to fall into this black hole. That doesn't mean that it's not a potential danger. Um, you know, sometimes these black holes become active, but not this black hole. Phew. <laughs> yeah, yeah, thank goodness. So tonight when we're looking up at the night sky, what should we be thinking about? The universe became a little bit clearer today, uh, maybe a little bit more ominous. Uh, black holes are real and they're out there. Um, maybe a little bit more fantastical. Uh, we know that these sorts of crazy objects exist and who knows what else. There is room, he says, for discovery. Melissa Duggan, City News.